I want to dedicate this award to my late dad, who was a doctor. Yes, yeah, so it means it is like we are replacing. Yeah. yeah so uh, that is to make me emotional, like cool here, like in here. I want to dedicate it to my dad, who is in heaven. What has really helped is the power of social media. The the correct use of social media is what the mentorship as well. We are competing with Nigerians, South Africa, people from US, all over the world. Mm -hmm. And then after that, after that, now is when I was awarded the honorary degree in philosophy in BA business administration now you can call me doctor Mark doctor. <laughs> doctor Mo, yes and, uh, maybe can you tell us the feeling you know having this it's a big thing uh, and also who are you going to dedicate the work to? oh the feeling is not yet in right now you know it's in your land so I, I, I'm gonna gasp in it in but I want to thank God first of all mm -hmm. I want to appreciate my family I want to appreciate I want to dedicate this award to my late dad who was a doctor Yes, yeah, so it means it is like we are replacing. Yeah, yeah? so uh, that is to make me emotional, like cool here, like in here. I want to dedicate it to my dad who is in heaven. Mm -hmm. That is for you also, uh, and to my spot on family, and to you fans and everybody that feels Max, Max Steve inspires them. This is just to show you guys that we are able to do this. We are young, we are, we are moving forward. Then we are here to inspire each generation. We are changing one life at a time, and also we are inspiring one life at a time. Max yeah. Steve, tell me. What is the feeling you being, you know, awarded the doctorate? Because I know it brought mixed reaction. You remember you like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that was a very, very. I, I'm gonna hold this uh, degree for close to my heart because it was a, a replacement of my dad, who was a doctor, Doctor Noguti. So now I'm coming again, Max Steve, Doctor Max Steve Noguti. So it means, it means that God always can always replace you in everything. It was very total emotions to rain over, but I thank God because this award means that the innovations, the creations that we have created with Spoton, the what we have done in terms of building the domestic tourism, international tourism, is being recognized. So it means what it shows to us, even the youth, is. Anything you do, like you do what you guys are doing through the what you guys are doing, people are watching. Mm -hmm. But it's not that you think people are not watching that you you are holding back. No, keep doing what you're doing. Mm -hmm. These things will come. I, I never thought Niki, when I was thinking in the right 45, mm -hmm. one day I'm gonna come back and be received by the media and also having an honorary degree mm -hmm. and getting all these awards. You know, it's it's God's game. So, but so what I always say, tell people the difference between me and you is time. Mm -hmm. My time is now. Your time is coming tomorrow. Yeah. So let's embrace the journey mm -hmm. and let's accept the process as well yes don't yeah. don't shortcut the, the okay. process mm. yes yeah okay. now that you are back and you know people are expecting you now to be up with you just already could you sana maybe mm -hmm. what are your plans we, we have amazing plans we have a lot of plans like in ghana maybe we, we already are in association with ghana, ghana tourism we want to open an office there in uganda we i met the uganda tourism organization so we're planning to on, open an office there now it's about expansion in africa what we want to do is we want to do we want to introduce something called global tourism global tourism means is whereby africans travel within africa Right, so a Kenyan can go to Uganda, support Uganda, Ugandan can come to Kenya, support Uganda, so that we establish this East, East, East African and African as a globe. So that's what we call global African tourism. That's what we want to introduce this year. We have already signed some uh, contracts, they are on under NDA, so I am not able to disclose them. But good things are coming, good things are coming in terms of tourism where I'm, I'm leading here. Yeah. Now, Maxiv, what next for us? Because now you have the doctorate, you have uh, the award, you have money, you have <laughs> fame, you have a team. This year, what plans do you have? Oh, I have so many plans. I want to inspire a lot of youth. I want to maybe maybe create a, a youth academy, maybe create a young youth entrepreneurship academy. Because all these all these trips that we make outside the world is to also to open up to us to know what guys are doing there we have youth who are doing crazy people i met uh, when i was in ghana i met a youth a young guy who is 23 years old and he has over 500 employees i was very challenged yeah so 23 and has 500 employees so he's into tech so uh, what you guys are doing is everybody has an opportunity to use the gadgets they have the tools they have to be able to create an impact and, and change so i'm looking on a way of how this year we can harvest these talents mm -hmm. in one place and train them to be able to also get a honorary degree and all these awards mm -hmm. yes maybe for kenyans they'll learn to understand this what you're doing is the trophy so this is the africa 40 under 40 awards this one i got it in uganda mm -hmm. yeah this is Oh, and she came. 
I to Del Cazozo. This one I got it in Ghana. Mm -hmm. This is the top 100 most influential young Africans 2024. This uh -huh. award. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then now this is the the famous the, the doctor, <laughs> the doctor degree. Mm -hmm. And also I was uh, I was in, instituted into the Global Institute of Leadership in SA. This yeah. one. Yeah. So I'm also a professional member. Yes. I think maybe uh, just to uh, my last. Yeah, number two is Kidogo. Do uh, looking back, looking back to years yeah. ago. Yeah. Do you think you've achieved what you wanted to achieve right now? Uh, Are you proud of yourself? I've I've always said mm -hmm. I've had dreams and I've, I've I'm halfway my dreams. Mm -hmm. I'm halfway my dreams and I thank God for that. Mm -hmm. That shows you there's the power of dreaming. Yeah. So even if you're working with friends who are not dreaming, please cut them off. Work with people who are dreaming, work with people that who are challenging you. Me, I work with people like we were with the CEO for Anna Coach on these awards. They, those are people that challenge me to also be a better person yeah. to also keep growing. Yeah. So, yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What has really helped you to be where you are right now uh, as a young man? What has really helped is the power of social media. The, the correct use of social media is what the mentorship as well the innovation as well because you remember where i was we used to do the we started the domestic tourism we were the first people who started the domestic tourism in kenya the innovation the leadership is what makes somebody become different yes and using your time rightly yes we speak a sharek like we also try to to build something yeah talking about social media I know you, you're very active on social media, sports yeah. on vacations are yeah. very active on social media. <laughs> I don't know now, we, <laughs> we have a, <laughs> yes, I don't know, we have this package for you now. Uh, Is that a package for you, for, for, doctor, may, for the doctors? Maybe, I, I don't know what the team have, has, they have planned for me, I don't know what the social media guy has for me. Mm -hmm. So I'll, I'll see, I'll wait and see, yes, yeah. You mentioned early on about moving with the right people, working with the, working closely with open-minded people, people yeah. who can challenge you. Yeah. I don't know about you. Did you have to make decision? How did you find yourself in a circle whereby the people you're hanging out is the people that are running the industry, they're making the right decisions? Uh, about friendship, you know, you have, you have to grade. I always tell my friends, you have to grade your friendship. You know, Kunole, Kunole when I do Kido is, if I want media, I'll call Kido, but Kido is my friend. If I want Shere, uh, I'll call somebody <laughs> for this. If I want serious mentorship, I'll call. So once you grade your friends, you first of all avoid a lot of disappointments. Yeah, you don't feel like you were expecting too much from Kido and Kido is not delivering. So you grade your friends, your mentor, the people that mentor you, always have a person that mentors you. There's some decision I cannot make before I ask some people. Yeah, so if you have, those are the people who are one step ahead of you. Because you are that step, you have not stepped that step. Mm -hmm. So you have to talk to somebody who has already stepped that step so that you follow their first step. And if you have a chance, you can penetrate on the side, not overtake them and create your own lane. Don't compete. Competition is never enough. Always create your own lane. Work with your own progress. What was your target for this year? You are targeting to open a company. And you have done it. That's good. You are moving. Next, you wanted to buy a car. You have bought it. You are moving. Don't want, don't, don't want to, like, you want to buy everything at the same time. Bro, it's going to be crazy for you. Yeah. Are you competing with the competitors? No, I'm not competing with competitors. What makes you think so? You're not competing. We are not competing. Why? We, why should we compete? Everybody's on their own lane. The cake is too big. Everybody's. We. Everybody's. Me. I'm creating my own lane. I'm. I'm. Ni metoka kaya your lane. So me ni koko lane yangu. Yeah. I'm just focused. I'm looking ahead. I don't compete. I don't compete. But we can complement each other because this industry needs all of us to work together. We need to grow. People need to understand the big the big impact. I was there in Ghana. People are talking about, oh my God, you're coming from Kenya. I want I want to touch a lion. I'm like, yo, we don't touch lions here. But you see, it, it shows like the good word is out there already. People want people want to come to Kenya, visit Kenya. So we just need to, I'm calling upon the KTB people, like let's work together, let's market Kenya crazy. And we're gonna make it, we're gonna be one of the top, 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 top uh, tourism destination. Yes. All right, Mark Steve, thank you so much. Maybe a last Sun. word to your fans and family and supporters. Oh. Support on family. Oh, first of all, support on family. You guys are an A1. Yani, you guys are the best. Thank you for holding me down. This I will never achieve this thing. I'm never see you without you guys. So this this award is for you and also to inspire you. So I'm always inspiring my team. Like I always tell them, tomorrow you'll not be here forever. Tomorrow you'll leave Spoton, you'll go and open your prison. But what person will I be able to create? Because even me, every person, 
for you to be somebody, you have to pass through somebody's hands. Yeah. You know that. So, so I'm, I, whoever passes through my hand, I want to challenge them. Like, don't make the same mistakes I've made. Make the same progress I've made. Or even do it better. And to my fans, I want to say thank you. God loves you so much. I love you too. And let's keep inspiring. If you want me to inspire you, I'm, I'm always open to ensure that to me on gear, to me discuss. I'll come buy you coffee, buy me coffee. We have a one or two. The best thing you can do is changing life is we start it by talking to each other. Yeah. If we don't talk to each other, then everybody is going to die around with stress and all that. Yeah. All right. Karibu sana. Thank you. Thank you. Sanders.